Hi there, I'm Whimsy. Whether you just dropped in or you've been following along with us for a while, I hope you brought your writing things. Time to get comfy and start our weekly prompts. It would be out of character for me to have a set of genre prompts without at least dipping into the fantastical. So, our final romance subgenre is paranormal romance. In simplest terms, paranormal romance stories combine the relationship focus of romance with elements of fantasy and horror. You can also find a scattering of sci-fi, mainly on the mad scientist side of the spectrum. Most genre elements and tropes in paranormal romance tend to come in the form of otherworldly people and supernatural creatures that populate the world and play an important role in the plot. Most often, they are the love interests and stumbling blocks of the usually human main character. Other common elements include supernatural abilities like telepathy, exorcism, or occult magic. As a result of all this, solid world-building is often essential to paranormal romance. To go with our genre, today's story prompt is A paleontologist and her grouchy guide run into supernatural shenanigans and each other's hearts while on the hunt for ancient dragon bones. Here's an image to go along with it. The sensory prompt is A strong flower perfume. And our restriction for today is Write in present tense. As always, you can use as many of the prompts as you like. Try all of them if you're feeling like a challenge. Let's set a timer for 45 minutes. I'll have the prompts and image up here for five seconds each, so you can pause and come back. You can also find the direct link to the image in the description, along with some writing music if you need it. Now, let's get writing. All right, pens down and fingers off the keyboard. Nicely done. Go ahead and have a good stretch, maybe a snack. If you still have some focus, why not set another 45 minute timer and keep going? When you're done for the day, share how many words or paragraphs you got down in the comments. Any amount of words is a good amount of words. I'm packing up my writing things for today. Next week will be a special prompt and the last one in this series, at least for now. See you then.